coming into your YouTube airwaves. It's Vaughn, the Statman, and welcome to the Stat Room. Woo! How is everybody doing? And welcome to the Stat Room. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so before I get into this five game slate, guys, let me introduce myself. I am Vaughn the Statman. You can follow me on Twitter at Vaughn the Statman and check out the website, VaughnTheStatman.com. Check out the comment section because that's where you'll see my information to follow me on Twitter. And sometimes I also post adjustments to the lineup. So it's good to come back to the video about 30 to 40 minutes before lock. All right, guys, so I gave some good information last night. The last two videos that I made, we did extremely well. So if you were to follow my advice, play those players, you probably made you some money. Okay, so on today's five-game slate, it's an interesting slate. It's a few games on here that has blowout potential, and it's a few games on here that look good. It's one game on here that has the appearance of a blowout, but could absolutely be close. And all that information will be sent out in my top players list later on today. All right, so let's start off. I always like to start off at the center position. And when you look at the center position, Vucevic is 10-5. I don't think he makes value against Phoenix. Randall is 9-5. I don't think he makes value against Utah. Adebayo, game stay close. I see him getting 40. Um, Aiton is still under eight thousand dollars i think that's a low price point i love aiden but the guy that i love guys <clears throat> i'm gonna give you white side white side and robinson don't shoot three pointers they both should start but i think white side has more upside he blocks shots just like robinson do but utah plays at a faster pace and i think he's gonna just have more opportunity because i think new york is gonna miss more shots than utah so I think he's going to have more of an opportunity to get second chance opportunities. Remember what I told you guys yesterday? Teams that are coming off emotional wins and emotional losses. New York just played an overtime thriller against the Lakers. They were up by 20 points and they lost. I think they are going to feel de defeated. And then Randall put up like 60 something points. Barrett put up 50 something points. Don't expect them to match that again. Okay, so now now let's go up and get our point guard in miami i think jimmy butler is gonna sit because they can beat washington without jimmy butler chris paul is still 10-2 i don't think you need to pay up for him or carry in this matchup or ball i'm fading all three of these guys i'm giving you van vliet van vliet against ball he's gonna force ball and some turnovers van vliet in my opinion is the best player that wasn't drafted in NBA history. He is the best undrafted NBA player in my personal opinion. And I think he's gonna ball out against Charlotte. Now at the shooting guard position, like I said, I think Butler is gonna be out. I think Booker goes crazy. Mitchell, I don't think the game stays close, but I do like him. Levine's gonna play, so. But Phoenix is a disciplined team. I think Phoenix is gonna, Phoenix and Chicago, that's gonna be a pretty decent game. Um, but at the shooting guard position, guys, I think Hero plays. So I'm going to go Hero. At the small forward position, this is just a cap-saving move. But I believe that he's going to have a, a good game. I think Gordon Haywood is going to have a good game against Toronto. And at the power forward position, guys, Siakam, I don't think he gets 50 again. I would say... Siakam probably will get you 45, which is cool. I say Randall is going to get you in the 30s. I like Adebayo. If Jimmy Butler don't don't play, I, I will go Adebayo. You got Barnes. So I'm going to go Adebayo, guys. And that's it, guys. So you got Van Vliet, Hero, Hayward, Adebayo, and Whiteside. So that's it, guys. So for the new members, um, check your email tomorrow so that's it guys so you got Whiteside, Adebayo, Haywood, Hero, and Van Vliet all right guys so that's it guys I am on to break down the rest of the slate so guys don't forget to win win that means give people what they want so you get what you want and guys don't forget to think in it that means write it down so that way it can come true and good hunting on Monday's five game NBA slate love you guys